Every moment in life is precious, but never truly safe. These videos show the moments leading up to very bad things happening in the world, so when someone catches one of these unexplained videos caught on camera, it's cool and scary at the same time. We are not sure how these people caught what they did, it could just be something they can't explain unsolved mysteries. In today's video, we'll count down top 10 mysterious videos you never seen before accidentally caught on camera. Before we begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content. Roberto Gaglielmi. An Italian man who went to great lengths to convince everyone that he had lost the ability to walk after being involved in a stage car accident 12 years ago was recently exposed as a fraud. The incredible story of Roberto Gaglielmi, an Italian con artist who managed to fool everyone, including doctors, neighbors and even the Pope, that he couldn't walk began over a decade ago. In 2007, he came up with a plan to pass himself off as a disabled person and collect the pension offered by the government, but he needed an accomplice to pull it off. At the time, he had someone living in his home who was behind on rent, so he proposed to forget about the payment he was owed if his housemate would pretend to hit him with the car while he was crossing the street. The man agreed and everything went smoothly. With the help of a false medical document, Gaglielmi was able to become a paraplegic, even though he could walk like a normal person. What's most remarkable about this tale of deception is the extreme lengths that the Florentine went to in order to deceive doctors during mandatory visits to confirm his disability. According to prosecutors, he would inject lidocaine into his legs to numb his muscles, undergo traumatic therapies and use a wheelchair whenever he left his home. For over a decade, no one suspected that he was actually a healthy person with full use of his legs. A deer trapped an icy pond. Reindeer are supposed to pull Santa Claus sleigh, but in Oregon recently, a red sweated man on a sled wound up pushing a deer. A deer wandered onto a frozen golf course pond in Sun River, Oregon, on Friday and then lost its footing and needed to be rescued by firefighters. The animal couldn't get all its legs underneath it. A video shows it skidding on the ice with its legs buckling beneath it. The young deer's hind legs began pumping, but it couldn't get up on its front legs. Johnston got close, spoke calming words to the deer, and, slipping a bit himself as it tried to gain traction, gently pushed it with the front of the sled to the edge of the pond. Even then, the deer needed some coaxing. The deer tried to get onto the sled before it turned around. Pushed once more to the snowy ground, it gained solid footing, and, with a wave from Johnston, ran off. It was the inaugural rescue mission for the sled, which was purchased with a grant from Firehouse Subs, a sandwich restaurant chain, she said. She hopes it never happens, but when someone falls through the ice, or is stuck on thin ice, the sled will be put to use. Dashcam caught in a tornado. Watch the terrifying footage of cars and people getting swept in a tornado's extreme winds, which show the danger of driving in bad weather. The video, taken by a car's dash cam, shows a car traveling down a road with trees either side of it. Dash cam video shows evidence of what was later determined to be a small tornado. Check it out. The video opens up pretty normal, and things appear to be fairly calm. But then just a moment later you can see, floating up in the air, what looks to be debris of some sort. In the distance, large pieces of debris can be seen flying through the gray cloudy sky overhead. The debris starts flying towards the window as the car battles on through the storm. A tornado is seen approaching from the horizon as a white car pulls in front of the vehicle with the dash cam. Suddenly, the video turns into a horrific scene, as if something out of a disaster film. Trees can be seen bent in half, while a huge number of random objects start flying towards the windscreen. At this point the view from the dash cam is completely obscured, as a huge grey cloud descends over the vision. Double amputee turns barren hills. Mars Anxilo, a 70-year-old double amputee and army veteran from Jingxing, North China's Hebei province, has pent the last 19 years of his life planting thousands of trees and turning the once barren hills surrounding his village into a small forest. Ma was diagnosed with blood poisoning in 1974 while serving in the Chinese army. 
His condition got worse after he retired, and eventually had both legs amputated because of it, his right leg in 1985, and the left one in 2005. After seven major operations and constant medical treatments, he could barely afford to take care of his family, and, because of his disability, finding a job proved very difficult. His veteran subsidy was enough to cover his medicine, but he couldn't remain idle. So in 2000, after getting inspired by another tree planting story on TV, the double amputee started planting parasol trees in the barren hills around his remote village, with the intention of selling them for profit. Zubingyang Friendship a 12-year-old boy from Mishan, in China's Sichuan province, has been hailed as a hero for making it possible for a disabled classmate to move around at school by carrying him on his back for the last six years. When he was only four years old, Zhang Ze was diagnosed with a debilitating and incurable condition called myasthenia gravis, which gradually caused him to lose control of the voluntary muscles in his legs, making it very difficult for him to walk on his own. While his parents dropped off Zhang to school every day they couldn't help him move between classes or go to the toilet when he needed to. Luckily, one of the boys' schoolmates stepped up to help. As soon as they met in first grade, Zubin Gaiang offered to help Zhang Ze get a class, reach the toilet, or get his lunch, and he's been doing it for the last six years. Zhu always picks up his friend at their school's entrance and carries him up the stairs to class, helps him turn in his homework fills his water bottle, and fetches his lunch. Zhang Ze said Zhu Bingyang is my best friend. Z thieves stole the statue of lion. In this footage, two thieves who stole a lion statue from a Pennsylvania home returned it, with flowers and a card, after police posted surveillance video of the crime. The thieves didn't come away empty-handed either for returning the lion statue. Daisies, lilies, and carnations are what the Bun family received, along with a typed apology note, on their doorstep after two suspected, thieves returned their stolen lion statue. Police department posted video of the lion statue bandits in 2019, asking anyone with information about the theft to contact the department. In the video, time stamped around 10.45pm, April 3rd. Two individuals are seen opening a fence, picking up a lion statue and running away. In a new video, the two individuals are seen carrying the lion statue back to the home, placing it in the lawn. Then, one runs to the doorstep and lays a bouquet of wrapped flowers on the front porch. Police said the owner was glad to have the statue back and told the thieves it was a smart move to return the property. In the note, the thieves said they were planning on returning the statue the entire time. Authorities are no longer looking for the thieves and the lion statue owners do not want to press charges. Dog saves his friend. In this surveillance video pulled by an Arizona family showed something remarkable, a dog saving his pal who had fallen into a swimming pool and struggled to get out. Smokey and Ramos were getting rambunctious earlier this month at their home in Mesa, Arizona, when Smokey fell into the family pool. In the video, the dog is seen struggling to get out, while Ramos was moving back and forth along the deck. He was caught on camera saving his best friend's life when he fell into their family's swimming pool, but was unable to get out again. Smokey fell into the pool causing Ramos to become visibly stressed. Ramos appears to try and pull Smokey out of the pool, but his attempts fail so instead he jumps in and pushes Smokey out of the water. And that's when the surveillance camera picked up the unexpected rescue. Ramos jumped into the pool to rescue his buddy. The Beceros were shocked by what they were watching back. Smokey now rocks a brand new life jacket to help him learn how to swim. And even though they say dogs are a man's best friend, Ramos and Smokey may beg to differ. They are best buddies with a wet nose to always lean on. Ingenious Sprinkler System Keabuki no Sato, a small hamlet in Kyoto famous for its traditional thatched roof houses, features a concealed sprinkler system that turns the whole place into a water fountain. Known as Miyama's Thatched Village, Keabuki no Sato has a higher percentage of thatched roof farmhouses than any other place in Japan. This makes it very popular with tourists who love walking among the over 40 traditional thatched roof abodes and even spending the night in one of them, but also very vulnerable to fire. 
Local officials realized this in the year 2000, when a fire burned down the archive center, so apart from asking people to be vigilant at all times, they decided to install a special sprinkler system to cover the whole hamlet. They tested twice a year, usually in May and December, and people from all over Japan and beyond come to see the powerful sprinklers in action. Before we begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content. With this being said, let's begin.